good morning everybody so today i really wanted to get my ish together i've been traveling for the past two weeks non-stop and i just feel really out of it i need to get myself back into a little routine so here we go so of course the first thing i'm gonna do is go to the gym it always feels good to move your body in the morning and i feel like traveling always throws off my little fitness routine so i really just wanted to get in there even if i did something light so that's what i decided to do i just did some stretching because i really want to work on my flexibility i did a little bit of weights and then also i did some cardio and for me just to get myself back into the swing of things i always start light and then i work my way up After the gym, one of my favorite things to do is make my own green juice. So I've been doing this um, for a while now and it has given me so much energy and I just feel so good <laughs> about myself. So of course we are gonna have the lemon, the kale, ginger, apple, celery, and cucumber. And oh my gosh, this is so delicious. Super refreshing and it just tastes so good. I could literally have this every day, twice a day. So with my green juice, I usually take my Ritual Essential Multivitamins for women 18 plus. And I've actually talked about this in a previous video. These have literally been my go-to vitamins. And um, I do want to say thank you to Ritual for sponsoring this portion of the video. But I did want to share my experience taking these vitamins so far. So I've been taking them for about almost two months. And I think one of my favorite things about these multivitamins is the fact that I can take them on an empty stomach because your girl be fasting. I definitely miss meals. So the great thing about these vitamins is that it uses a delayed release capsule design. So basically that means it takes longer to dissolve in the body. And instead of dissolving in the stomach, it dissolves in the small intestines which can help avoid you know upset stomachs and things like that so these fit perfectly into my lifestyle and they are made for me <laughs> they are also very transparent with the ingredients they are traceable you can know the where the why and the how so that is also very important to me so i literally just take two of these a day and that is it so if you guys want to check out these ritual multivitamins you can use my code shanice 20 to get 20 percent off your first month the link will be down below in the description box so once i pretty much feed myself i'm gonna go take me a nice shower and get ready for the day hey guys so as you can see i put on some makeup got myself together did my little morning routine um, I felt good. I really, really, really needed to get back into a routine because I have been traveling for the past two weeks, a little bit over two weeks, and I just felt so out of it. I felt like a slob. I felt just not like myself. So it was really important for me to like just get my ish together. So that's kind of what I did this morning. Went to the gym, taking my vitamins, drinking me a green smoothie. I'm kind of like fasting because literally when I was at the hotel, I was eating nothing but fast food every single day. And I was just, ugh, I felt so sick to my stomach. So yeah, I'm about to do my hair. I'm actually going to an event later today in LA. Um, it's for Farfetch. Farfetch is coming out with like a beauty line. So that's really, really cool. You guys know Farfetch. They sell like designer luxury items and stuff like that. So yeah i'm a little nervous because i'm going by myself usually i bring like a plus one or i go with like a friend or something but i'm going by myself this time so hopefully i see somebody that i know or i might not stay there long because i'm a little awkward and my anxiety will just like go through the roof so <laughs> i'm trying to put myself out there you know baby steps you have to put yourself out there so that's why i was like okay let me just do it let me just go so that's what I'm doing. So I want to show you guys something because actually I was able to pick out an item on Farfetch. Um, they allowed us to pick out an item worth like $500. So I got me a shirt. I'm going to show you guys right now. I didn't, it literally came today. I was like low-key hoping that it didn't come. So I didn't have to go to the bed. But it came. Darn it. I'm just kidding. <laughs> so I seen this actually on somebody and I thought it was super cute. I just hope it fits because you know, European sizes are just real different. So let's hope. It came in this cute little bag. 
And I don't know, I really like Jack Moose's items. I feel like they're very affordable, but also really, really like nice and just more so my style. So I got this really cute pink blouse. Can y'all see that? So this is what it looks like. Hopefully the color is picking up true. Okay, this is the real color right here. So cute. And then it has like the Jacquemus detail right here on the front. It just says Jacquemus. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. And then it's open in the front. It just has that little clasp. And then the back is also open. So I guess this is called the Le Splash. I don't know. But I just really, really love the color. I'm gonna see what I'm gonna wear with it because I actually have no idea. Like, it could look good with shorts, but then it might be too much skin. But we're gonna figure it out, so come with me to my closet. Okay, so this is what the top looks like. It definitely needs to steam or iron. I don't have a steamer, so I'm going to have to iron it. Um, I just love the color, it's so pretty. My closet. I was even thinking I could do some white pants possibly oh my gosh where are my other white pants <gasps> do i not oh my gosh i don't damn okay so like yeah i was even thinking some white pants can go with it but this has like this brown stitching in it which i don't know if i really like um and i really have no more white pants i was like what the heck what happened to my jeans from top shop but i guess i gave them away so we're gonna try this and then see what it do okay so this is what it looks like sorry for my room like literally i just came back from vacation trying the white pants i did not like it at all so i think i'm gonna do the blue i need to iron both of these items i'm gonna do the blue with some heels i might change the heels still deciding i just want to see how it would look with white heels and then I'll do my Jacqueline's bag, you know, just keeping it on the same brand, I guess. It's gonna come together. I think it's gonna come together once I like do my hair and I iron literally everything that I'm wearing. Like look at my jeans, wrinkly, wrinkly, and then the shirt is so wrinkly. And then I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do to my hair. So, I will be back. Sorry, I didn't get to show you guys my outfit. I was in a rush. But it came out pretty cute. Ooh. But y'all, I didn't put on any freaking tape. So it's like the wind is not playing with me. <laughs> Okay, but no, like look at how freaking cute. Movie's out. 
We were out. They are sitting nice and pretty. <laughs> yes, Jack Moose. Yay. Yes, ma'am. Oh, she was so cute too. Look how she's glowing, guys. Hey, y'all. So just got back home from the event. It was a super cute event. Um, got to meet Symphony and a few other girls as well. We got to take home some goodie bags with a bunch of stuff, which I'm excited to go through. We got full-size perfumes in here too. Like, y'all. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm gonna miss LA so much. I'm gonna miss LA. Super excited about this, but I don't even know if I really got to show you guys a full thing of my outfit, like a full view. So I'm gonna insert some photos. It still won't be a full view, but you guys will get the picture. Um, yeah, uh, I literally changed my outfit because it's so cold outside. So I'm going to be heading out with Jasmine and Mona. We're going to some event or something like that a real chill event and uh, i'm gonna show you guys the goodies that i got probably tomorrow um because i don't even know what's in there myself it's gonna be a little surprise for both of us so let's go She invited us to this um, little event and then we got free drinks, so yeah. Perks of work. That was so cute. We're about to go eat. I haven't eaten anything all day. I'm so hungry. At these events nowadays, they have, because we're in LA, they have hummus and lettuce. Hummus? That's what they had. That's what they had the event. <laughs> they had hummus and lettuce. Oh my God. With some nuts on top. And oh I just, God. it wasn't enough. <laughs> oh my God, we're having a birdie. We're having. We are going to. The Belmont. I locked my car. I can lock it from the app. This is a nursery. And they have so many different varieties of plants inside, and it's beautiful. I took a shower and I laid in bed for a little bit. I don't know, I'm super, super tired, but Runny Canyon was fun. And then we went to Earth Cafe after. 
amazing amazing food i had myself a wild mushroom pizza Ooh, it was so good but yo i ended up getting an email from my my building and they were like how the elevators aren't working something happened they're working with the lapd and the lafd and all of this stuff like something non-violent um so there's this app called the citizen app and hi stormy and it pretty much tells you everything that's happening in the area in la um and i went on it and uh, okay so first of all when i came inside the building there was just like police everywhere um it looks like they were going through security cameras this and that and the third and then i go on the citizen app and people are posting like in the comments and stuff like that they, they do like live videos and things like that they're like saying how the reporters and the police were saying that two dead bodies were found in my building some people are saying it was fentanyl um and they the two dead people are supposedly um, or allegedly maintenance workers so I was like wow something serious is happening all I know is two dead people rest in peace but I don't know exactly how it happened or what happened so that is what's going on luckily when I came back though the elevators were back working because it would have been crazy to walk all the way up here I'm on a pretty high floor so <laughs> anyways I want to show you guys what I got from Farfetch now since I didn't get to show you guys yesterday. My nose is very stuffy for some reason. So if you hear like my sinuses are kind of clogged or I sound like I'm underwater, that's why. Okay guys, so this is everything that I got from the Farfetch event. I see a few new products here that I've never seen before. Even new brands that I've never seen before like 111 Skin, Epilogic. I've never heard of these brands before. Um, we got some Jouer, their repairing lip mask, some Charlotte Tilbury, um, RMS Beauty, they sent me their blush, I'm very excited about this, Olaplex, so I've actually never tried this Olaplex number 8, so I'm excited to try this out, I was trying to stock up on the Olaplex because they had like other products too, but they ran out. So that was unfortunate. I really wanted to get some number threes because <laughs> that's my favorite. Um, this lip gloss from Shante Kali. Probably pronouncing that wrong, but this is really, really pretty. It gives your lips like a natural pink tint. And then they had full-size perfumes, y'all. Stormy, what are you smelling? Yeah, they had full-size perfumes. So... I actually got the Burberry Her, and I've actually heard so many things about this. It's I've seen this in a lot of people's collections, so I'm really excited to try it. And I know it's on the sweeter side, and I kind of like sweet perfumes. I'm super excited to try out all of these products. Thank you so much, Farfetch, for having me. Super exciting. Stormy, do you want to say hi to everybody? Let's show them your new t-shirt. What are you looking at? <laughs> Okay, bye bye. Come here. Come here. Thank you, Bubby. You giving them a kiss? Mwah. Anyways, y'all, I am about to make myself some tea, do some laundry, clean up this house because it is a hot, hot, hot mess. Oh my gosh. So I was, I've been gone for two weeks. I had to pack for two different trips in two different places. So I went to Cancun for one week and then I went to Texas for another week. And yeah, now I'm back. And it's just like my house is a mess from packing prior. <laughs> so yeah, and I'm literally packing for another trip now. So it's just really, really hectic. I'm excited for you guys to see where I'm going, but all of my travel vlogs are on my other channel called being nisi which i'm probably gonna change to shanice crystal vlogs i'm not sure yet so you guys definitely definitely have to go subscribe over there we are going places this summer okay it's gonna be amazing it's gonna be so much fun and everybody really likes my travel vlogs so if you guys are not subscribed you definitely must head over there okay thank you
Y'all, I just got me some panini kebab grill. My freaking HelloFresh order didn't come this week, so I'm literally like eating out, which is so annoying. I didn't prepare any meals. So yeah, I love getting this chicken kebab from there. And I'm watching this documentary called Our Father. It is so crazy, like what? Comment down below if you watch this already, cause what the hell? I forgot it was a solar eclipse today, but look at the moon. So gorgeous. It is very, very orange right now. Wow. I forgot it was a solar eclipse today, but look at the moon. So gorgeous. It is very, very orange right now. Wow. I forgot it was a solar eclipse today, but look at the moon. So gorgeous. It is very, very orange right now. Wow. <laughs> 